This Canadian actor's voice is helping put people to sleep, but not in a bad way. <laughs> it is the lightest and most delicate of sounds, almost imperceptible, as though the lake has also gone to sleep, breathing softly on this spring night. That is Shamir Anderson, who you might recognize from the latest John Wick movie. Shamir is hosting a new Audible series where he narrates listeners to sleep alongside majestic sounds of nature taken from all over the world. We are catching up with Shamir this morning to learn more about this and some of his other projects. Welcome. I, I, I'm glad that your beautiful voice is over this terrible construction that's <laughs> happening behind it's us. very loud this morning. It is. But it's all good. Listen, I'm gonna, your voice is too good to waste. Can you read my first question oh my to you? Goodness. I wanna hear you read it. Is it right here? Yeah. When someone says your voice puts them to sleep, it's usually a bad thing. Both your new podcast, it's actually a good thing. <laughs> Is that okay? Yes, that's wonderful. Can I get when, a job here now? Yeah. Can you guys hire me, please? Right now. Um, <laughs> when did you realize you had this gifted voice? I'm still figuring out why they hired me for it, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, I always think my voice is annoying. Like, who doesn't? Um, but hey, Audible called and they said, hey, Shamir, we want you to be the new voice for Sleep Sound and put people to sleep. And I said, sign me up. And now we're here. I love that so much. Listen, another project that you worked on recently uh, was released in theaters. You star as Tracker in John Wick 4. Yes. That is major. Congratulations. All of Canada much. is very proud. What's the story behind how you got the role? How I got the role, um, I worked on a movie with Halle Berry called Bruise. And mm -hmm. Chad Stileski, our filmmaker of John Wick, was on that set. Remember the work that I did on that and gave me a call and said, hey, I'm doing John Wick 4. Take a peek at the script. If you like it, it's yours. And I was just like, is there, what's the catch? Like, do I got to do anything? He's like, no, if you like it, it's yours. And as simple as that, and usually these casting processes are so robust and you gotta do so many screen tests and whatnot, and he just trusted the work that I've done and he hired me on the spot off of a Zoom. That says a lot about you and about Thank your you. work on the set previous, for sure. Mm -hmm. um, your passion outside of acting is DJing. Yes. And, and he smiles. And I understand <laughs> it helped to pay the bills is, you know, when acting was a little bit slow before people were just throwing parts at you. Yeah. Uh, you actually got to play a set, I love this, at the John Wick uh, premiere in LA. Yes. What kind of response did you get from your fellow actors when they saw you DJ? Uh, they're like, you DJ? Since <laughs> when? I'm like, since forever. Um, and they were dancing, they were partying. It's really great when you get to see like, you know, Keanu Reeves, you know, turning it up on the dance floor. I mean, that's, that's like, being in John Wick's one thing, but having Keanu dance to your music, I mean, that's, life's good. Yeah, life is very good. And I don't know if we can go back to that first picture, but I love the sticker on your computer when you're DJing because it says Scarborough. Listen, Scarborough. you may live in Hollywood now, but you are a Scarborough guy yeah. at heart. I am. You always pay homage to your Scarborough roots. And there's a lot of people who've come out of Scarborough. Mm -hmm. Lily Singh, don't she just, I mean, those, that's just in the entertainment world. Yeah, yeah. Music and acting and sports. Yeah. What, listen, somebody one time said to me that it's in the plantain in Scarborough. <laughs> That's what makes everybody famous. It's in the plantain. I love it's, you said plantain, not plantain. It's Thank in, you for the record. Uh, yeah, it's in the plantain, it's in the beef patties, it's in, <laughs> it's in the curry goat, it's in the rice and peas, and it's at Scarborough Town Center, believe yes. it or not, ladies and gentlemen. Scarborough Town Center has all the sauce. What was happening at the Scarborough Town Center? There's huge talent that comes out of that part of yeah, the Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I mean, a lot of great people. Some in the water, you know what I'm saying? Some in the water. Mike Myers is from Scarborough. Yes, you know, that's right. He went to Stephen Leacock, uh, which is my home school. I'm from Bay Mills. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, shout out Bay Mills, shout out Scarborough, and uh, I'm, I'm a proud Scarberian. A proud Scarberian. Uh, what's it been like to see your nonprofit grow so much? Last time you and I talked was during pandemic. Mm -hmm. It was over a Zoom, and you were launching a Black Academy. I was. And it's doing so well. Yes, yes. Uh, it's been since the launch of that. We launched it during the pandemic. We've since produced the first ever Black Award show, nationally broadcast on CBC, celebrating Canadian Black talent. And we got nominated for four Canadian Screen Awards this past weekend. We didn't win any, but I, I've been saying this all weekend and leading up to the award show that we've already won to be able to put on something like this for our country mm -hmm. to celebrate you know, Black individuals doing great work in this country on a national stage. And my brother and I are so proud and already working on season two of the Legacy Awards. Oh, that is fantastic. Yeah. Congratulations. Can you do me a favor and just, I don't want everyone to go to bed, but I do want to relax them. Can you say enjoy the rest of your morning? Enjoy the rest of your morning. <laughs> Have a great day. I'm Shamir Anderson. And watch me and listen to me and fall asleep with me on Sleep Sound on all. Fall asleep with Shamir Anderson. There's an invitation. All right. <laughs> thanks, Shamir. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. This is great. This is awesome. 
thanks for watching. If you liked this, be sure to subscribe here, or you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.